It's daybreak in Marja. For guys from the 28, every day begins early, but most begin food first. Let's go out. Some sausage for you. Corman Caleb Short and Lance Corporal Benjamin Curtin keep them smiling through the line. The food is edible, but it's not great. Afghan Army and police, though, travel across camp to eat with these Marines. A sure sign, they say, that lasting relationships are near. From there, today was camp cleanup day. Everyone takes a bag and no one's exempt. Once cleanup is done, the real work begins. Construction is taking place all over camp. Hansen has been here for a while and is still growing. Making sure everyone has what they need. Well, Second Lieutenant Matthew Mayer covers that. A bit of clutter, um, just due to the amount of the limited amount of space. Space to house the food that supplies the 43,000 meals here each month. Mayor, a former White House and State Department intern, joined the Marines to fight the war he'd spent years arguing for. Now his days are spent making sure these Marines have what they need inside Camp Hansen to be safe outside the wire. Now, if ever you wanted a clear illustration of how dangerous this war is, here it is. Take a look. This MATV was hit by an IED two weeks ago with guys from the 2-8 inside, but thanks to a V-shaped hull and some newly designed body armor special to the wars in Afghanistan and Iraq, everybody inside was okay, and the Marines say this truck will likely be fixed and then used again. V-shaped hulls are designed to direct the blast up and out, away from the uh, passengers. Mayor says the design saves lives and money. Spare parts are cheaper than buying these brand new. Most fixes are more mundane. These guys are working on a leaky valve. But anything that could cause problems has to be addressed. A breakdown away from camp could be deadly. As more Marines head out on patrol, Mayor knows more of their vehicles will come back looking like these. But he's confident these guys will have what they need to get the job done, no matter what that job is. At Camp Hansen, Afghanistan, Chris Brown, Eyewitness News 9, on your side.